Currently we have 61 structures with about 33 different species of coral in our nursery. The coral nursery is designed to grow a stock supply of corals, which allows us to harvest and continually plant fragments at the restoration site. We usually collect coral fragments and colonies from nearby reefs that have been damaged, broken or are in the path of a nearby development project. The fragments are then secured to mineral accretion structures. Mineral accretion is a technology where a low voltage electrical current is run through iron structures in the water. This technology has been shown to increase the growth and resilience of the corals. For most coral species, about six months in the nursery is enough time before they're able to be fragmented and outplanted. Our biggest challenge by far is anthropogenic driven climate change. This has increased the frequency of coral bleaching events and reduces our production capabilities. Maintenance is very important for a healthy nursery to ensure best possible survival and growth rates. This includes monthly cleaning to remove sponges, algae and any major predators. We also shade our nursery during bleaching events and perform health checks to identify signs of bleaching and eliminate any diseases before they can spread. A well-run nursery is not only essential to restore the coral reef at our restoration site, but ultimately to support the oceans to bounce back and recover.